The boat that's right behind you is a Pursuit ST310. It is a big So you can do straight down dives. The roominess of these boats, they're very well thought out. Check this out! <laughs> this is called Flyboard! Hey guys, Eric Kyle here, publisher of Great Lakes Scuttlebutt Magazine, and I'm excited to be at the Detroit Boat Show. This is a fantastic event. We're having a wonderful time. Great boats, fantastic people, and some good news to report on. As a matter of fact, I'm here with our friends over at Riverside Mar Marina. Riverside Marina, yes. Yvette, how are you? Nice Hello. to see you. Well. Yeah, so tell us, Riverside Marina, what's going on over there? Ah, well, this is our second year that we are, second season that we are in the marina business. Okay. We are excited. The first year at the boat show, so very excited about that as well. Yes. With a lot of new folks in, a lot of new return folks as well. So things are exciting. This is the old Harbor Hill Marina from what I remember, is that correct? Right. Okay. So you guys are right down down on on uh, Freud, is it? Fruit, yes. Okay, so you're right on the Detroit <laughs> River. Yes. Fruit is what it's called, not Freud? You know, I guess it depends on the grass. <laughs> <laughs> it's a beautiful facility though. Tell us about some of the things that you have to do over there. Uh, well, we actually have full, it's a full service marina. So we have uh, jacuzzi, hot tub, uh, uh, heated swimming pool, two banquet halls also available. Oh, really? So, yes. Okay. Large, large hall upstairs, downstairs. We offer inside via storage, outside storage as well. Several events that we have going on throughout the year, constantly keeping uh, our residents entertained and also guest residents entertained, uh, guest stop, and, okay. and retail stuff. There is a lot going on over there. There's a lot going on all the time. Yeah. A new mentality from what I hear. This place is really booming. It's really shaking. There's a lot of great things going on down there. How are you guys keeping that vibe going? Mm -hmm. uh, just being excited. Yeah. Just being excited about what we're doing and the folks that we're servicing. So mm -hmm. just uh, just stay on try, try and stay on top of it as well. Well, it's not only phenomenal staff, but the marina itself has got great access to whether or not you're going up to Lake uh, St. Clair or you're going to go down the river, try to get down to Lake Erie. Talk a little bit about the marina. How many slips, transient spots, all that kind of stuff? Uh, well, we have, uh, for Riverside, we have 375 uh, slots available. And then we have a number, just a, some that we set aside for transit guests as well. Okay. And it is great. It is a great location, great for the boat races, fantastic views for that, for uh, fireworks. Oh, nice. Fantastic. Yeah, absolutely wonderful views for that as well. Okay, okay. Now, the Sister Marina, right down the road. Tell us a little yes. bit about that, if you wouldn't mind. Irma Henderson. Yeah. I think we have... Somebody's going to talk to Sarah, talk to, talk to us about Irma Henderson. If Sarah sister. would like to come over and tell us a little bit about it. You're going to tell us a little bit about Irma Henderson Marina. It's a beautiful place right there in downtown Detroit as well. Yes. Where, where exactly are you located? We're located right off the Jefferson and Van Dyke, right across from the Bella Isle. Oh, perfect. So the location as well, very convenient if you want to be downtown or go up to Lake St. Clair. Do you guys get boaters that kind of come from both directions? Yeah, we get, I had a boater that came all the way from, I think it was like, Okay. <laughs> well, the location over there is fantastic. Tell us about some of the amenities of Irma Henderson Marine as well. Well, some amenities that we have are um, we have events, special events like fish fries and live music on the water. Okay. And we have um, restrooms and showers and um, washers and dryers. And we also have a convenience store inside of the office. Well, that is fantastic. Now, both of these marinas, they have floating docks over there as well? Yes. Okay. Both of these marinas are all under the same group, correct? Yes. Okay. If I wanted to find out more about either Irma Henderson Marina or Riverside Marina, and I can't make it down to the Detroit Boat Show, tell me, guys, where am I going to go online to be able to find out more information or to be able to order a dock? You can actually go to Riverside Marinas, that's with an S, dot com. Okay. For, um, for Riverside and was it Irma Henderson? Is it Irma Henderson or just Irma Henderson? Irma, Irma Henderson dot com. Irma Henderson dot com. Yep. Not Irma Henderson Marina, just Irma Henderson dot com. 
Henderson Marina. IrmaHendersonMarina.com. So if we wanted to go onto either one of those websites, we can find out more information about the facilities yep. and contact you guys if we're interested in getting a doc. Absolutely. Right? You want the phone number also? <laughs> sure, you can give it to the us. The phone number for Riverside is 313-447-5319 and Irma Henderson. Irma Henderson Marina. Um, phone number is 313-824-2457. Outstanding. You guys, you did an absolutely wonderful job telling us about these beautiful facilities down there. From what I hear, great location, fantastic location, very affordable as well, fantastic uh, different things to do down there, so all the kind of accessories are really good as well. Sounds like a perfect place to dock to enjoy your fun, fun and sun out in the summertime. Okay, you guys, thank you so much. Check them out, IrmaHendersonMarina.com or RiversideMarina.com, and they can hook you guys up. We'll see you out on the water. Thank you.